Did you ever see the Steiners pull nasty ribs on people? Rick taping up Dink, both Steiner brothers slashing Ludwig Borges tires. Many shoots throughout the years have them pulling crazy ribs. No, I I never saw the Steiners do pull a rib on anybody, actually. Um, I didn't know they slashed Ludwig Borges tires. I that I don't know why they would do that. That's not that's not a rib. That's vandalism. <laughs> See, there's a difference. A rib is funny, you know, to somebody on this deal. This is just nasty. I don't know why that would uh, would happen, but they might have had a had a gimmick, uh, had a had an angle going on backstage. I don't know. Our friend Lash Larue used to say that they pulled a lot of pranks on Disco Inferno. Disco says no, that he was buddies with them, but he has said that they pulled some ribs. Disco even admitted a few times that you know he tape him. Like Rick and Scott would tape him somewhere so he couldn't get away, right? Or or they'd be on a jet ski. He they'd knock him off the jet ski so he couldn't get back on. Right. Well, that's a rib. Yeah. <laughs> I yeah. mean, in wrestling, you know, if they like, if they don't like you, they ain't gonna mess with you. But but if they like you, sometimes it, it's it's you know, being part of a rib. It. Yeah. I I don't. Uh... Apparently, during a live show, oh. I guess it was a house show, they stripped DDP naked many many years ago. And taped him up so he like couldn't, and they threw him out where the fans were. <laughs> yeah, well, that might happen too. And I just saw Rick taping up Dink. Now that I, yeah. I, I think probably did happen. I mean, yeah. you know, I would see that, but but once again, <laughs> the atmosphere, the the vibe was different, and 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 it was uh, anything I say is going to be held against me in a court of law. But the point is, it was fun, and for that time period, and the guys who were involved in it. I would think understood what it was. And it, and it was the craziness. It wasn't everyday life. <laughs> it was, it was the circus. It was doing that. And that's why we got in it because you didn't want to be every day, the same thing over and over and over and over. So. Did you ever hear the one with Sean Waltman? Rick Which one? <laughs> well, Which Rick, one? Rick apparently got a, a gun with blanks. And he was like pretending he was going to shoot him, and mm. Waltman was you know pretty scared, and he did shoot him with the blank. He thought he he literally thought he was killing him. Yeah, it's because he thought Rick was nuts. What was he doing? But he shot him with a blank, and you know they they well, you know those blanks as, we, as we've known through the years can hurt somebody and, yeah. and yeah. kill somebody. So he's lucky he didn't get in trouble. But but I, I know. <laughs> Because uh, I got into this on the Twitter thing with Taker talking about when he walked in, you know, you had real men in the locker room with guns and knives and all that stuff. Okay, yeah. well, a, again, a different era, different time in, in history. And I don't expect anybody to to think that would be normal in a normal society, but this wasn't. It's in the wrestling society. Here the go. legendary Bob Cook, the man with the second yeah. greatest punch in the business. I saw Rick Steiner chasing the junkyard dog around with a gun one night in a dressing room. Needless to say, the dog was sweating bullets, pun intended. Right. But but <laughs> once again, the dog, Scott Steiner, dog knows he's not going to shoot him, but he doesn't know he's not going to shoot him, but he's going to put on it. He, he's He's in my opinion, I think they were both having fun working. Well, how could that be fun? The guy's chasing you with a gun. I don't know. You're cutting a promo. <laughs> you, you, you're doing a vignette. Whatever it is. It's for the entertainment of the boys and yourself. And I know as barbaric that may sound, it, it was a lot more fun back then. Thank you for watching the Hannibal TV Please help me out and like this video, then click the subscribe and get notifications buttons so you don't miss any of my latest shoot interviews, match videos, or news updates. Follow us on Facebook at The Hannibal TV for more live streams and videos. And while you're at it, follow us on Instagram and Twitter at The Hannibal TV.